Hey everyone, it's Miss Hernandez back for another lesson. Today's lesson is going to be 114. What lesson? Get ready. Yes, 114. But before we start, we're definitely going to do a warm up. Today's warm up is also going to be common information. Um, let's start off with what do we call a person who helps a doctor? Get ready. Yes, a nurse. Say the whole thing about a nurse. Get ready. Yes, a nurse is a person who helps a doctor. Let's see, what about, what do we call someone who helps keep people safe? Get ready. Yes, a police officer officer say the whole thing about a police officer get ready yes a police officer is a person who helps keep people safe what do we call a person who helps people get well get ready a doctor say the whole thing about a doctor Get ready. Yes, a doctor is a person who helps people get well. Awesome. All right, we're going to go ahead and start with our lesson now. Listen, here's our first game for today. Everybody touch your nose. Get ready. Keep touching it. What are you doing? Get ready. Yes. Touching my nose. Listen, tell me if I do the same thing you're doing. Watch. Am I doing the same thing you are doing or am I doing something different? Get ready. Yes, the same thing. Now watch. Am I doing the same thing you're doing or am I doing something different? Get ready. Yes, something different. Now watch again. Am I doing the same thing you're doing or am I doing something different? Get ready. Yes, the same thing. Watch again. Am I doing the same thing you're doing or am I doing something different? Get ready. Yes, something different. Listen, everybody, I am doing something different. Say the whole thing. Get ready. Yes, you are doing something different. Watch again. Am I doing the same thing you're doing or am I doing something different? Get ready. Yes, I am doing something different. Everybody say the whole thing. Get ready. Yes, you are doing something different. Awesome, good job. Listen, here's a new game. Everybody point to the ceiling. Get ready. Good. Now tell me if I do the same thing you're doing or something different. Watch. Am I doing the same thing you're doing or am I doing something different? Get ready. Yes, something different. Say the whole thing. Get ready. You are doing something different. Watch. Am I doing the same thing you're doing or am I doing something different? Get ready. Yes, the same thing. Say the whole thing. Get ready. Yes, you are doing the same thing. Good job. 
that exercise was a little bit long, but you sure rocked it out. All right, let's go ahead and go on to the next exercise. Listen, get ready to tell me why things I name are the same. Listen, a boat and a motorcycle. Think of them. Why are they the same? Wow, that was a really good response. Here is one way a boat and a motorcycle are the same. They both take you places. Everybody, why are, are they the same? Get ready. Yes, they both take you places. Listen, a chalkboard and a paper. Think of them. Why are they the same? Awesome response. Here is one way a chalkboard and a paper are the same. You write on them. Everybody, why are they the same? Get ready. Yes, you write on them. Listen, a boot and a hat. Think of them. Why are they the same? Get ready. Great response. Here's one way a boot and a hat are the same. You can wear them. Everybody, why are they the same? Get ready. Yes, you can wear them. Now let's see if you can answer these questions. Why are a boot and a hat the same? Get ready. Awesome, you can wear them. Why are a boat and a motorcycle the same? Get ready. Yes, they both take you places. And why are a chalkboard and paper the same? Get ready. Yes, you write on them. Awesome job. Listen, I'm going to name some things that are in the same class. You're going to tell me the class. Listen, apartment building, theater, house. They're in the same class. Everybody, what class are they in? Get ready. Yes, buildings. Listen, tiger, monkey, elephant. They're in the same class. Everybody, what class? Get ready. Yes, animals. Listen, car, train, tricycle. They're in the same class. Everybody, what class? Get ready. Yes, vehicles. Listen, soup, toast, egg. They're in the same class. Everybody, what class? Get ready. Yes, food. Listen, shirt, hat, socks. They're in the same class. Everybody, what class? Get ready. Yes, clothing. That exercise deserves a round of applause. Super easy and super fast. All right, next exercise. Let's see how much information you remember. What do we call a person who helps keep people safe? Get ready. Yes, a police officer. Say the whole thing about a police officer. Get ready. Yes, a police officer is a person who helps keep people safe. Listen, what do we call a person who goes to a doctor? Get ready. Yes, a patient. Say the whole thing about a patient. Get ready. Yes, a patient is a person who goes to a doctor. Listen, what do we call something you take to get well? Get ready. Yes, medicine. Say the whole thing about medicine. Get ready. Yes, medicine is something you take to get well. Listen, what do we call a place with lots of fruit trees? 
Get ready. Yes, Anne Orchard. Say the whole thing about Anne Orchard. Get ready. Yes, an orchard is a place with lots of fruit trees. Good job. All right, next exercise. We are going to play a word game. Listen, I'm thinking about a man who is not tall. He's the opposite of tall. So what do you know about him? Get ready. Yes, you got it. He's short. Listen, I'm thinking about a ladder that is not wet. It's the opposite of wet. So what do you know about it? Get ready. Yes, it's dry. Listen, I'm thinking about a chicken that is not young. It's the opposite of young. So what do you know about it? Get ready. Yes, it's old. Oh my goodness, that exercise was super easy and super, super short. Let's keep going. Listen, we are going to talk about plants. This is a plant. This is a plant. This is a plant. And this is a plant. Now we're going to talk about each picture. Is this a plant? Get ready. Yes. Say the whole thing. Get ready. This is a plant. What kind of plant is this? Get ready. Yes, this plant is a flower. Say the whole thing about this plant. Get ready. Awesome. Is this a plant? Get ready. Yes, say the whole thing. Get ready. This is a plant. What kind of plant is this? Get ready. Yes, this plant is a tree. Say the whole thing about this plant. Get ready. Awesome. Is this a plant? Get ready. Yes. Say the whole thing. Get ready. This is a plant. What kind of plant is this? Get ready. Yes. This plant is a carrot. Say the whole thing about this plant. Get ready. Awesome. Is this a plant? Get ready. Yes. Say the whole thing. Get ready. This is a plant. What kind of plant? Get ready. Yes, this plant is a bush. Say the whole thing about this plant. Get ready. Awesome job. I think you are becoming a master at plants. Listen, this exercise is a little bit different. These pictures tell a story about what a dog did. I am not going to point to the pictures. Listen, what did the dog do first? Get ready. Yes, chased a cat. What did it do after it chased a cat? Get ready. Yes, chased a dog. What did it do after it chased a dog? Get ready. Yes, chased a bird. And what did it do after it chased a bird? Get ready. 
yes, went to sleep. Listen, what is a dog doing in this picture? Get ready. Yes, sleeping. Now think hard. I'm not going to point to the pictures. What did it do just before it went to sleep? Get ready. Chased a bird. What did it do just before it chased a bird? Get ready. Chase the dog. And what did it do just before it chased the dog? Get ready. Chased a cat. Oh my goodness. You did awesome in that exercise. All right. Listen, we are going to solve a problem. These objects are in the same class. Think carefully. What class are they in? Get ready. Yes, animals. What kind of animal is this? Get ready. Yes, a monkey. What kind of animal is this? Get ready. Yes, an elephant. What kind of animal is this? Get ready. Yes, a zebra. Listen, the man will feed the monkey or the elephant. Say the whole thing. Get ready. Yes, the man will feed the monkey or the elephant. Now answer these questions. Will he feed the elephant? Get ready. Maybe. Will he feed the monkey? Get ready. Maybe. Will he feed the zebra? Get ready. No. Now let's see if we can figure out which animal the man will feed. Remember, he will feed the monkey or the elephant. Will he feed this animal? Get ready. Maybe. Will he feed this animal? Get ready. Maybe. Will he feed this animal? Get ready. No, that animal is not a monkey or an elephant. Listen, we know he will feed the monkey or the elephant. What do we know? Get ready. Yes, he will feed the monkey or the elephant. Listen, I'll tell you something about the animal he will feed. The man will feed the animal that has a trunk. Everybody, tell me which animal will he feed? Get ready. Yes, let's see if you're right. Listen, which animal is the man feeding? Get ready. Yes, the elephant. Say the whole thing about what the man is doing. Get ready. Again. Get ready. Yes, the man is feeding the elephant. Now answer these questions. Is anyone feeding the monkey? Get ready. No. Is anyone feeding the zebra? Get ready. No. No one is feeding the monkey or the zebra. Say that. Get ready. Again. Get ready. Awesome job. Something tells me we're getting really close. Listen, 
Some of these objects are plants. Some of them are buildings. Is this a plant? Get ready. No. Is this a plant? Get ready. Yes. Is this a plant? Get ready. No. Is this a plant? Get ready. No. Is this a plant? Get ready. Yes. Is this a plant? Get ready. No. Now listen. Is this a building? Get ready. Yes. Is this a building? Get ready. No. Is this a building? Get ready. Yes. Is this a building? Get ready. Yes. Is this a building? Get ready. No. Is this a building? Get ready. Yes. Good job. You didn't get tricked. Listen, this time when I point to an object, you'll say plant or building. Tell me, plant or building? Get ready. What kind of building? Get ready. Yes, a house. Say the whole thing about this building. Get ready. Yes, this building is a house. Tell me, plant or building? Get ready. Plant. What kind of plant? Get ready. A bush. Say the whole thing about this plant. Get ready. This plant is a bush. Plant or building? Get ready. Yes, building. What kind of building? Get ready. A store. Say the whole thing about this building. Get ready. This building is a store. Plant or building? Get ready. Yes, building. What kind of building? Get ready. Yes, a barn. Say the whole thing about this building. Get ready. Yes, this building is a barn. Plant or building? Get ready. Yes, plant. What kind of plant? Get ready. A tree. Say the whole thing about this plant. Get ready. Yes, this plant is a tree. Plant or building? Get ready. Yes, building. What kind of building? Get ready. A school. Say the whole thing about this building. Get ready. This building is a school. Good job. Guess what? We did it. We got to the worksheet. All right, go ahead and take your worksheet out. All right, you should be ready in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Awesome. Everybody has their worksheets. Listen, up at the top, when I clap, hold up your pink crayon. Get ready. Awesome. What color is that crayon? Get ready. Yes, pink. Everybody, you are going to color the rabbit pink. So put a pink mark on the rabbit. What color is that mark? Get ready. Yes, pink. Everybody, 
you are going to color the bear brown. So put a brown mark on the bear. You have five, four, three, two, one, and zero. What color is that mark? Get ready. Yes, brown. Good job. Listen, everybody, you are going to color the lion orange. So put an orange mark on the lion. You have five, four, three, two, one, zero. What color is that mark? Get ready. Yes, orange. Later, you are going to color all the objects. Remember, the marks show you what color to make the rabbit, the bear, and the lion. You'll make the other animal any color you want. That's right, you get to pick your color. All right, down at the bottom, find a boy. Did you find a boy? Good. You're going to fix some pictures. Here's the rule for the boy who is not sad. The boy who is not sad should be wearing glasses. What should that boy be wearing? Get ready. Yes, glasses. Draw glasses on the boy who is not sad. You have 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, here's another rule. The dog that is not big should have a long tail. What should that dog have? Get ready. A long tail. Draw a long tail on the dog that is not big. You have 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Awesome job. Here's the last rule. Cross out everything that you didn't fix. You should be done in five, four, three, two, one, zero. Awesome. Now go ahead and turn your worksheet over. You should be there in five, four, three, two, one, zero. Awesome. Listen, find the fire engine. Yes. Everybody, this picture shows a fire station. What does the picture show? Get ready. Yes, a fire station. Touch a firefighter. Are you touching him? Awesome. Listen, make the uniforms black. What color are you going to make the uniforms? Get ready. Yes, black. Put a black mark on one of the uniforms. You should be done in five, four, three, two, one, and zero. Listen, touch the fire truck. Are you touching it? Awesome. Make the fire truck red. What color are you going to make the fire truck? Get ready. Yes, red. Put a red mark on the fire truck. You should be done in five, four, three, two, one. Touch the fire pole. Make the fire pole yellow. What color are you going to make the fire pole? Get ready. Yes, yellow. Put a yellow mark on the fire pole. 
You should be done in five, four, three, two, one, and zero. Touch the firefighter's axe. Awesome. Make the axe green. What color are you going to make the axe? Get ready. Yes, green. Put a green mark on the axe. You should be done in five, four, three, two, one, and zero. Remember, the marks show you what colors to make these objects. You ready to move on? Awesome, go down to the bottom. Find the fish and the circle. Do you see them? The boxes at the top show what the other boxes should look like. Touch the first box at the top. It has a fish as the first object and a circle as the second object. Listen super carefully. Circle every box that has a fish as the first object or a circle as the second object. You should be ready in 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and zero. Awesome. Listen, the other box at the top has a triangle as the first object and a hat as the second object. Circle every box that has a triangle as the first object and a hat as a second object. You should be done in 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and zero. Awesome. We have our last rule. Listen, the boxes that you didn't circle are wrong. Cross them out, please. You should be done in 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and zero. Awesome job. Later, you'll fix each object that is circled so it looks like one of the boxes at the top. All right, that was it. Again, it was so nice to teach you this lesson and so nice to see you again. All right, we'll see you back on Monday.